Okay, guys, so this is Mix Assignment 7. We're going to be using the pitch control slider, okay? Mix allows you to change the tempo and the pitch of an entire track using the pitch control slider. All right, moving it gradually up increases the rate the track plays, which is the tempo, right? And slightly bends all the pitches of the track higher. Moving the, sli the slider in the other direction has the opposite effect. So it's going to make the track a little slower, and it's going to make the bend the pitch down to be lower a little bit, okay? You can give this, a, kind of gives the music a warping effect, right? So watch the tempo changes as you move the slider. You can right click the slider to reset it. So let's go over to mix and load a track in. And of course it's going to be triangle waves. Yep, always triangle waves, right? So here's the regular. Right? We want to use our pitch control slider, which for deck one is going to be right here, okay? And if we wanted to do it on deck two, it would be right there, okay? But we're focusing on deck one, so our pitch control slider is right there. So all you got to do is simply grab this and slide it up or down, okay? And you're actually going to see the waveform here, okay? The waveform is going to actually expand or contract depending on how you move this, and you even see the beat grid go with it. The white lines, the beat grid, right? The beat grid, if it goes up, we'll get closer. Beat grid will get farther away if we move it down. Why? Because you're moving the tempo. Because you're changing the tempo. You're actually making it slower or faster. So it's stretching it out. If you move it down, stretching it out to make it slower. And if you move it up, it's stretching it in, squishing it in to make it faster. When okay? this one only goes up to eight. It doesn't, this one doesn't change very much, yeah. Um, but you'll notice the pitch control slider is what changes when you do the syncing and the beat matching, which is what we did in, like, number three. Okay, so if I play this, if I reset this to the middle, and I play it, here's how it sounds normally, right? Now let's move the pitch control slider up a little bit. Field speeding up. Go back to normal. Okay. It goes up to eight. So, it goes up to ten. what's happening here is it's stretching the whole thing, uh, actually it's squishing the whole thing to make it, it, it tighter, which speeds it up a, just a little bit, makes it go faster. So it sounds like, um, it sounds like what? It sounds like you're kind of being pushed and like, you know, things are going faster, things are speeding up. You, you might hear this effect in some kind of a, uh, a, a movie, it's like a warp effect, it sort of gives, gives tension, builds tension as it, if it goes faster, right? You can also slow it down. Which might sound like what? Sound like something is like slowing down because it's like dying or, or something is happening, right? Maybe a ro when a robot dies in a movie, it sounds like... It slows down and the voice gets deeper because it's bending the, the tempo of the sound down, bending the pitch down, okay? So we can do that a little bit. You only get plus or minus 10, you'll see here. You only, get, you only get plus or minus 10 beats per minute. Okay, down, Going down, you get less, uh, minus 10. Going up, you get plus 10. Here's the middle, 90.23. We can go up to 100. Almost. We're down to 80. We're back to the middle, okay? So all you have to do is make a new recording, okay? For options, record mix, right? Make a new recording using that pitch control slider. Start in the middle so we hear the normal sound, then move it up a little bit, then move it down, or vice versa, it doesn't really matter. But at some point it should be normal, and then you move it up and down. That's easy, right? It could be a 20 second recording to show that. The slower you move it, and the smoother you move it, it usually sounds a little cooler that way, as opposed to just right? If I move it really quickly, Different effect. Cool. But it could be cool too. Depends. It's a different effect if you move it quickly or if you move it if you move it more fast. Okay? Cool. That's it.